in the previous video, we already test our knowledge about angles and tangents of circles. Now, let's enhance our skills by doing this exercise. Textbook, page 162 and 163. Skill enhancement. Let's see these questions. In the diagram on the right, O is the center of the circles and M N is a tangent to the circles. Okay, M N is a tangent to circles means here is 90, 90 degree. Given that the angle of L K N is 52 and L and M L O is 136, calculate the value of X. Okay, let's see. X is here. I enlarge this one. Okay, okay, X is here. So, first, let's see this quadrilaterals. This big quadrilateral. So, we need to find some things around this side. It's not a cyclic quadrilateral. We need to find some all the angles here. In order to find X, we need to find all the angles. Because a quadrilaterals, the total angles in a quadrilaterals is... 360 so we need to find all the other angles here we already get this one we already have this one we don't have this one we don't have the angles of n oh we don't have the angles of l o n so how to find l o n remember this one is inside the circle and we can find the angle of L, O, N, which is equal to 52 degree times 2. Okay, so this, this angle is twice times 2. So, that means the angle of L, O, N equal to mm, 104. Okay, 104. So, if we already got this value, the angle of L, O, N, which is... Mm, 104 so we can find the value of x then the value of x equal to x equal to 360 right 360 minus 90 minus 104 minus 136 okay we minus all the angles inside this quadrilaterals with 360 because we know that all the angle inside a quadrilateral is 360 then we get the value is 30 degrees so x equal to 30 degrees subtle one questions now let's see question number two Okay, question number two. In the diagram on the right, show a circle with center O, A, B, C is a tangent to the circle given that B, D equal to B, E. Okay, the length. So, that means this one is a side isosceles and the angle of C, B, D is 65. Okay, remember, if you see a tangent to a circle and inside the circle, we have a triangle. So, that means the angles between the charts and the tangents are equal to the angle at alternate segment substandard by the charts. So that means if here, I enlarge this one. If given this angle is 65, which the other angles that equal? This one. This angle equal to 65. And this one is isosceles. I so this. <laughs> so that's mean angle here also 65. Next, the question asks you to find x. Remember, if this one 65 means down here is twice. The angle is twice because this one is meet at the center of circle. That's mean x equal to 65 times 2 which is equal to 130 settle question number two next move to the third question the third question in the diagram on the right shows a circle with center o 
and C D E are tangents to the circle given that the angle B C D is 48 degree. They ask you to calculate the value of X. So X from here to here I enlarge this one. Uh, okay. The angle of here is from here. So that means the angle X is from B D E. And so in order for us to find this angle, we need to find this little small angle because we know that CDE is a tangent to the circle. So that means from here to here is 90 degree. Ah, so X, our X, angle of X will be equal to Mm, angle of B D O plus O D E O D E is ninety degree. This one B D O. <laughs> so how to find the B D O? It's equal to we want to find this one first. The angle of B O D equal to one hundred eighty minus. 48. Why? Because this one is 90. This one is 90. So this angle plus this angle is 180. To find this one, we need to take 180 minus 48. So we got 132. 132. If here is 132, here and here is the same. So that means the angle left and right is the same. That means to find the angle of B D O equal to one hundred eighty minus one hundred thirty two divided by two because left and right is the same, so we get the angle of B D O equal to twenty four degree. So we know that the angle of X equal to angle B D O plus O D E. O D E is ninety degree. So X equal to 24 plus 90 equal to 90 plus 24 90 plus 24 equal to 114 settle question number 2 next move to the third question eh third question oh that one question number 3 ayoo so, we move to the last question. The diagram on the right show a circle with center O. AD is a tangent to the circle. Given that the angle of PSR is 15, calculate the value of X. Okay, look first. Where is our X? Our X in this triangle. Okay, I enlarge this one. Enlarge. Okay. So, the X in this triangle. A, B, C is tangent to circle. That means this one is 90 degree. So, in order for us to find X, because we know that triangle is 180. So, we have this one is 90. We need to find this one. How to find this one? Okay. Here, we can see a half, tri a half butterfly. This is a half butterfly. Half butterflies mean if here is 15, at the middle is twice. So let's mean here is 15 times 2, which is equal to 30. Then we got this triangle at these positions is 30 degree. So I if I take this triangle out, we will see like this. That, 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 that. 90, 30, x is here. So how to find x? x equal to 180 minus 90 minus 30 then we get the answer equal to 180 minus 90 minus 30 60 so we get x equal to 60 degree okay settle with our Skill enhancement. Thank you for listening. And we only have the self mastery after this. Bye.